The stress that comes with this battle against the YouTube partner is incredible. This guy can send people to attack me and say anything they want to, and I can do nothing in defense. All I have is my video camera, and I turn it on upon my computer to show the comments that they bring. If tomorrow brings more of these hateful comments with homosexual innuendo, I have no other choice but to call the authorities of YouTube. I've given Paul Zavane enough time to say something. Grab his camera and tell these people to leave me alone because all I have is an opinion. But apparently, Paul only wants women to have opinions on his page. He only wants females to comment on him because a male is a threat to his ma mankind. I'm catching a cold because of all the stress, my immune system is down. It's almost 12.30 on election night. It's the 5th right now. I'm drinking a monster drink because I'm scared. If I go to sleep, I wake up in the morning. Paul has told the people at YouTube that I've attacked him. In kindness, I pull the video that so affected him so much, that so enraged his followers. And then as another gesture, I pull the video that was after that one, after they had already threatened me. I told the people who watched me not to do anything. But apparently, Mr. Savane is not telling anyone anything. He's allowing his uh, so-called fanatics to attack me and berate me with homosexuality on this internet. This is a partner who can't even voice his opinion to the people who watch him. Maybe what they're paying him is so incredibly high that he can't afford to lose one viewer. But I doubt that. I proved in the video I just done that. Based on the videos I have and based on the videos that he has. My overall ratings are higher than his. But he still may have more views. I don't know. I'm not part of that. Because I am not a partner. But I know if I was a partner and someone didn't agree with me, I'd allow that person to be themselves. I wouldn't send out a hit squad, try to rattle cages, force someone into showing something or doing something that's beneath them. very pitiful that Paul hasn't stepped up to the plate to tell his followers his viewers, his YouTube family members to stop the harassments for a partner you would expect this man to have a different set of standards considering he believes that partners need to have separate rights from us regular YouTubers but I have just proved this point that not all people are ready to be partners. If you look at these series of videos that I've just placed out recently, based on this drama, I've told everyone who watches me to leave these people alone. Over the last few days, I have been the only person trying to put forth an olive branch. But yet and still, all this has started based upon comments in which I made. Comments that were no more than you come off creepy in certain videos or in your videos. They attacked me, but they didn't seem to attack anyone else who comment against Mr. Savane. So since they attacked me, I assume they attacked me only because I am not a partner. And they think they would invest some, some fear in me. They would install some fear in me by 
threatening me in their last few videos. I mean, their last few comments. I am not a partner. He is a partner and I will be erased. I am not challenging this man in any way, shape, or form. I just gave my opinion. But if he erased everybody that gave an opinion, he'd have no viewers. He'd have no comments. Therefore, he'd have no revenue from YouTube. I know this. If they start charging people for the internet, how many people are going to pay to watch Paul Sylvain? How many people are going to watch somebody with a crazed look in his eyes allow his minion to run rampant across people, threatening people, not with words, but with drama? Leave Paul alone, or you'll have to deal with us. Who are you? Who is he? Who am I? What is the lesson we're learning from this? We're learning that when you give people partnership, they believe they're godlike over every other person on YouTube, and they believe that they're better because they were chosen. Chosen for what? Fucking pennies? Honestly. If I was getting paid 10 cents per view, 5 cents per comment, 2 cents per whatever, and another 10 cents per video comment. How would I stack up against Paul Sylvain? If I would have kept my highest ranked video, I would have already surpassed him with that one video already. But I pulled the video off because of sensitivities in the community. I will pull a video with no hesitation but now I'm going to put videos back on there's a few videos that you need to see again based on this new drama I'm getting from Paul Sylvain the original video that started all this drama will go back up Paul I'm going to ask you for the last time you stop the ants from crawling through my kitchen, and I won't spray the bug spray to kill them. But, if you do not stop your minion from running rampant across the internet, I will have no other choice but to contact the necessary authorities to let them know that you do not care about what your people do in your name. On several of those replies that they've put in my personal messages Paul sent this to you Paul sent us to you Paul 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 if you allow these people to use your name Paul then you allow to fall by their deeds I will not allow anyone from the real AIX or someone who calls themselves my viewer to say anything negative about you. But if I have to say something, I will. I'm not about to lose my page because you can't control your people. So I'm going to tell you for the last time. Tell these people to stop in a video, Paul. Or I will. Thank you. And you've been tubed. And believe me when I tell you, you have been tubed. You have been tubed. But not like these videos they're sending me. Not like these images they're trying to put in my box. You have been tubed by those people in which you call your fans. Good night, baby.